Hi. It's Esko here. After this fun in the south, here in Finland we have to wait the gravel to be brushed away to get our road bikes out. So, as usual, my option for a winter ride was to stay indoors. This clip is from yesterday. I tested the route that the Finnish National E-Cycling Championships were to be ridden today and I registered uh, to the Masters category. As the field seemed to be quite small and mostly stronger than me, and as I had felt weak lately, I expected it to be dropped too soon to make any actual fun or workout out of the race. So instead, I decided to join this Zwift Games race in category C. So I sorta found myself jumping out of the frying pan and into the fire. As this route, three little sisters had the hilly KQM for a starter, then Titans Grove and as the third sister up the volcano. The difference between the national champ race and this one lies mostly in the depth of field, instead of some 25 riders like the Finnish Masters ride would have. This had 250 riders and everyone a cat sea rider like me. So here we go. First hilly KQM is short, but this first part is a bit pitchy with a 11 percent in the corner. And uh, I had just adjusted my weight to include the extra two kilos I had gotten in the week or so. So that wasn't to help me keeping up with the peloton. So at the banner I had dropped from the pointy end. This is something that will gather as a group three. But here we actually are already bridging to, to group two. As you see on the minimap, the peloton is near and not pushing that much. So I decided to encourage our group to work in order to gather more pace downhill. So very soon we actually united with the peloton. I like these big category starts. It means that one is to ride hard, but still many can keep up with the peloton enough to get their real workout. Also, whenever I find myself being dropped in these big events, there's always someone to share the workload with or to compete, compete against. I also like these rollers. They underline how one has to read the race and anticipate both the terrain and the other riders constantly, and that saves a lot of energy. 40 or 30 of us stayed together most of the climb up the volcano. But just a bit before the peak, you see those 20 strongest, uh, strongest riders, they ride away, or I fade, whichever. You see the time difference on the right hand side, only 9 seconds to that group ahead. But uh, still, I don't have the legs nor the mindset. So, I get dropped. Getting down from the mountain and towards downtown Vatopia uh, in a small bunch we kept brisk pace but nothing exceptional happened. So, almost there. I had planned to sprint the last 300 meters but the Dutch rider here opened his sprint earlier and I wasn't playing, paying enough attention to what's going on. A bit stupid mistake and not legs to respond that far behind. So still some final sprint and the finish. What a nice ride together. Very, very uh, nice chatting all the race through. Thanks everyone. See you next time.